Okay, well we've got this iterative formula here and we're given the first approximation x0 equals 1.25 and we've got to get the three other approximations x1, x2 and x3 and give them to four decimal places. Now you can get these very easily on your calculator just by entering 1.25 first of all into your calculator. So if we were to do that just type in 1.25 and then all you've got to do then is press equals. And if you do that it's stored into your calculator as the answer. Next you've got to enter this formula but wherever you see X with a little subscript 10 you've got to press the answer key. So it's going to look something like this. You enter the formula I've entered it as 1 divided by the sign of answer so you just press the answer key when you get there plus 1 divided by 4. There's plenty of other ways that you could enter this onto your calculator. It depends what uh, mode you're in. But as long as you enter something along these kind of lines but the important point is that wherever you get X with the subscript 10 you press the answer key okay down here. Now once you've done that all you've got to do is just keep pressing equals. So when you press equals for the first time it's going to give you the first iterative result x1 in this case. It's going to display something along the lines 1.30375 and some more digits depending on the display of your calculator. Well if we've got to give this to four decimal places then this is clearly going to be 1.3038 okay to 4dp. And then to get x2 all you've got to do is just press equals again. And if you do that then you'll get the second iterative approximation. Okay, so to four decimal places this is going to be 1.2867. Okay, so that's to 4dp. And finally to get x3 just press equals one more time and again if you do that you'll get this result which to four decimal places is going to be 1.2917. Okay, and so there they are, our three other approximations to the root.